Hey everyone, this is Mitch here with another Logic tutorial. This tutorial is going to be over saving channel strips as performances and what that does for us and exactly how to do it. Alright? So, check it out. You have this song that you've been working on for a long time with all these plugins and all these settings. And uh, say this is a band, theoretically, and they want to make another song, okay? And you're like, well, shit, I don't want to have to do all those plugins all over again for each one of those channel strips. That would not be fun, and that would take too much time to get them exactly perfect. So, Logic has this really, really nice thing called performances, and you can save these channel strips as performances and open them up in any Logic file that we want. Very, very useful. Very useful. So, um, say you want uh, this bass to be saved as a performance so you can open it up in a different project. Alright, so how to do that is you come up here and you left click on this rock stack and it opens up and down here there's a performance output. Um, turns out I already have rock bass, I think this exact one saved, um, but doesn't matter. This is where you will be able to access all of your performances. So to save them, all you do is save as performance sick I know simple so save as performance be like bitches be trippin program number two okay alright so now we want to open up bitches be trippin in another logic file so I'm going to open up a new logic file here quickly close save uh, yeah sure and get an empty project up here okay so check it out we want to create an audio file because that's what the performance was was an audio and then if we click on this left click and come down to performance we can see bitches be trippin and we can open that up and have the exact same plugins and everything that we had in our last logic file it's as simple as that and it helps so much so much it helps so everyone i hope you learned something from this um, i know this is a short video but um, i feel like this can save a lot of people a lot of time and it's something that you really really need to know um, so th thank you for listening and tuning in uh, please comment rate subscribe like always cuz you know this is an awesome ass tutorial you know what I'm saying and if you have any recommendations on future videos that I need to be doing hit me up I'm always open to that stuff um, so yeah y'all have a great day